Midnight Guys Indigo Eclipse here. And I did a video yesterday on how to do a spell jar for like loving energy in your home. And I realized um, when I was doing it, I was putting energy into the items and, and into the spell jar. And I, I don't think I've ever really walked through with you guys on how to do that. Um, it's pretty simple. If you've been um, working with energy and learning how to channel it through you, then it really doesn't take much but a little bit of focus. So I'm trying to think on how to guide you guys through this. Um, I know I've done a few kind of guided meditations. So basically, you just start meditating. You close your eyes. You um, take some time to relax. You feel the energy moving through your body. And um, once it... Once you fill it all over and you feel like it's very strong, then you take it and you can direct it through your hands into the item you're holding and focus the energy and the intent with that energy into the item. Um, and once you've done it quite a few times, you don't have to hold the items. You can get to a point where you can direct the, the energy from a distance you can even get to a point that's how um, like distance healing works and stuff um, you focus the energy and it takes some practice and some time to be able to direct it that far usually you need a, like an image of the person or, or something like that you need to know where to direct the energy but that's going into a whole nother thing right there it's it's very simple really it's it can get frustrating when I first started learning to do it it was incredibly frustrating because it just felt like it wasn't working but daily practice of pulling energy into yourself um, there are many different techniques uh, imagining roots coming out of your feet going down into the core of the earth and bringing up white light through those roots up into your body and um, I like to connect the um i like to connect into the earth but i also like to imagine um light coming down from i don't know the universe whatever you want to call it uh source whatever you believe in is sending divine energy down and it mixes together in your body that's how i like to do it and then I direct it out for whatever I am needing it for. I could be putting it into an object. It can be trying to distance heal somebody. Um, it can be, you know, putting my shields up, my circles up. I work quite a bit with energy. Um, I, I wasn't always that way. When I first started the craft, I was very much into my items and my herbs and my tools. And I still use some of those, but um, mostly my work is energy based. That's how I function and how I work best once I learned how to do it. So there we go. Try to practice daily, bringing that energy into yourself, filling it, um, fill up your body and directing it towards whatever it is you're trying to use it for. And don't forget you do need to ground after you're done with your energy work. You can imagine the energy going back to where it came from out of your body if you're um had more than you needed i guess if that makes sense after you send out the energy if there's still you feel like there's plenty extra in you then ground yourself you can do it by connecting to the earth sending the energy back to where you got it from um, one of my favorite ways is to take a shower water is fantastic for rebalancing your energy and cleansing it. So that's my favorite way. And it's simple. It's very simple. Okay. I think that's it. Practice, practice, practice guys. You will get this. Thanks for watching.